whole experience with the NHL so far and how you're liking it. And... Yeah, you know, it's it's definitely been um, it's definitely been uh, fun and exciting. And, uh, you know, it's it's definitely um, something that I'm gonna remember for a long time. But it's uh, it's also something I take advantage of. Um, a lot of guys don't get too many chances up here, and you know, it's definitely something that I have to take, that I have to try and uh, strive for to, to be a complete NHL player. I'm sure a lot of people would like to know, like. Were there players that were influential to you that, you know, you're trying to, um, that inspired your game and, you know, how, the way you play? Um, not, not so much. Uh, you know, there's players that you, that you look at and, you know, you idolize growing up, but, uh, when it comes down to it, it's all about your game and how you compete on the ice and how hard you work, uh, on and off the ice. So that's something that I, that I pride myself on and something that I, I have to continue doing. And now who got you into hockey originally? Uh, it was my parents that got me into hockey. Uh, it's been in my family for the past couple of generations, so, um, it's just been passed on it to five kids, but, you know, it was definitely my parents and, you know, they've supported me the whole way through. That's your dad, who played in your family? Uh, dad, uncles, cousins, my little brother, uh, it's, it's gone. It started a, a while back, but you know it's definitely. Uh, I've gone the farthest so far in my family, and you know it's it's pretty exciting. And what does that mean to you? I mean, just to be able to be at this level. And... Um, if it wasn't for them and all their support, then I don't think I'd be. Uh, I have to give a lot of credit to them. They, they drove me to the rinks every, every game. They they supported me every game through uh, minor hockey, through junior, and now uh, even in the pros, they, they supported me the whole time. So it's definitely a, a huge contribution uh, from the whole family. That you know that's the reason why I'm here is because of them. And now, what's, I know, you know, like I said, you had a couple games under your belt, but are, are there still any adjustments that, you know, you're finding yourself still learning, or do you oh, think that... Uh, oh, yeah, definitely. Uh, you know, there's always things that you have to work on, and uh, that's what practice is for. If, if you don't practice on them, then you're not going to get better at it. Uh, the number one thing for me right now is face-offs, and, you know, guys are a lot bigger, a lot stronger on their sticks, so there, there has to be those things that I have to work on to beat them, and, you know, quickness is, is definitely going to be one of those things. That's what I was about to say, like, is the game really that much quicker once you get to this level versus it's like the AHL and everywhere else. I, it's it's not so much uh, guys are slower and stuff like that. Guys are just I think a lot smarter. Um, you know the puck the pucks moves a lot faster and you know it's, it, if uh, you take your eye off it for one second then it, it could be in the back of your net in, the, in your own zone. And, um, it's something that uh, I've realized up here and you know it's something that uh, I, I have to work on. And it must it must be good for you to have some of your Bridgeport teammates up here to be able to share the same locker room with them. Oh yeah, definitely. You know. Um, with Ollie up here and he, Anders was, was here for a bit, it's definitely uh, it's definitely exciting. You know, it's definitely fun to share the experience with them. And have you been able to talk to any of the veterans? Maybe just you know. Yeah, you know, they're they're definitely uh, they definitely helped me through it. And, you know, tell me what I need to work on and stuff like that. So they're definitely a big help. And you know, they, a couple of guys have been in the league for a long, long time. So you just kind of kind of keep an eye out on them, see what they do extra, see what they work on, and because uh, you know they they've played in this league a long time, and uh, those little things are gonna are gonna help me hopefully play in uh, this league for a long time. Has there been like any one experience where you just find yourself standing there and you're just like, you know, like have you been to like a place and you're like, oh my god, I'm really, you know, in Chicago or Detroit, yeah, you know, uh, like the historicals in NHL. So. Yeah, you know, in Boston, uh, that was pretty exciting. And uh, my first game in Canada uh, was in Ottawa, so, you know, a lot of my family friends came up and it was definitely exciting. You know, this weekend coming up is, is definitely going to be be a big one for me. Uh, hopefully I'll get to play in Toronto and, you know, if I do, it's... It's definitely growing up in, in the rink that uh, I watched uh, one of my favorite teams playing uh, growing up. It's definitely going to be exciting and, you know, something I'm looking forward to. And talk about playing here in New York and the fans here. I mean, is it exciting for you as a younger player to be here in New York and oh, play? Oh, yeah, definitely. Um, you know, in the atmosphere that we have, you know, the history in this rink and, you know, our, our fans are, are great here. Uh, they're, they're crazy for us and, you know, they show a game in and game out. So it's definitely exciting and, you know, it's something that uh, I take pride in. And if a younger player were to come up to you and ask for maybe some of the keys that, of your success, what would you have to say to them? Uh, work ethic. Um, you're not going to get anywhere if you don't work hard. And you know, if you if you go out there and you, you work your hard, you put everything out, you leave everything out on the ice. You know, people are going to notice that, and that's only going to make you a better player. So that's definitely one thing if I have to tell somebody. It's definitely uh, keep your work ethic up and uh, just keep striving for it. Thank you for your time.